Greetings, welcome to another reaction tasting video from Technically a Conversation. We are Jose and Isela yeah. from Technically a Conversation. And what do we have here today, Isela? We have the lovely, or so we hope them to be, <laughs> Dunkin' Donut flavored beers. Yes. So those of you that follow our podcast, you know that we've been on a mission to find them. And we finally succeeded. We still haven't been able to find the Arby's Curly Fry Vodka. All signs seem to indicate that it's sold out. Sold out. But we're still on the lookout. But as promised, we found all four varietals of Harpoon's Dunkin' Dozen. Yep. So can you go through some of the flavors that we'll be tasting today? <laughs> sure. We're going to go in order as you see them here. So we're going to try the pumpkin flavor first. That's your favorite. I know you, you're you a big fan of pumpkin. I'm glad we're taking that one first so I can just get that shit out of the way. <laughs> and then we're going to dive on over into the midnight flavor. That sounds way more delicious. This one, I'm already a little on the fence because it's called Blueberry Matcha, but it's an IPA. I love IPAs. I love IPAs too. Those are my favorites. And I like the Blueberry Matcha drink. I'm just not sure about them marrying together. Anyway, lastly, we're going to round it out with a maple cream, which sounds extremely sweet, and I'm not looking forward to that one. That one's actually the one that I'm looking forward to the most because I love maple cream. All right. Let's dive on in. All right. So... Dunkin' Pumpkin, girl, your favorite. Cheers. So we have, uh, just before we start, all our, we've expertly poured out each beer into a little cup. It's a very technical system. It is. <laughs> it took us a very long time to be able to master it. So uh, we're, just so you don't think that we're all drinking four whole beers, we, no. we're cutting in half. So we're drinking about two beers worth. Yeah, in like two minutes. Yeah. No, just <laughs> so let's see the Dunkin' Pumpkin. It actually smells all right. Oh, it's way, uh, it's way more bitter. It's, I really like it. Oh my gosh, it's very tasty. I knew right off the bat this was going to be your favorite since you're a huge fan of the pumpkin. Good lord. But um, <laughs> I don't feel that it tastes very pumpkin-y. Like it's got a very... I think that's why I like it. That must be why I like it. Because it doesn't taste like pumpkin. But it's got a lot of bitters. Yeah. Or it, it's got a bitter, like IBUs, I guess. Yeah, and it's not sweet. I thought it was going to be sweet. Not sweet at all. I think that's going to be more in this uh, blueberry matcha action. I hope you're right. Yeah. All right. That was really not as bad as I prepared myself to be. All right. So drink a little bit of water to cleanse the palate. I'll swig that shit. Okay. Now we're going to try Midnight. Dunkin' Midnight. Midnight. Cheers. It's all right. <laughs> Sorry, I have to throw in a little bit of Iron Maiden in there. <laughs> this one smells really good. You can tell it's, oh, it's like, it's almost like a the left hand nitro. Yeah. It's got a little bit of that, but not as, uh, not as punchy. Not as punchy. Yeah. yeah. Very, um, stoutish though. And it mm -hmm. does, and it is on the milder side, similar to how you said to that, uh, milkshake. it's really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. The left hand nitro. There you go. Yeah. Automatically, this one now takes first place for me. Okay. Yeah. I did like the pumpkin. Knock that chat out of the way. This one's definitely better. All right. I like so, it. Palate cleanser? Yep, yep, yep. I like how scientific we are, <laughs> cleansing the palate. <laughs> right. We should almost like <laughs> gargle with <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> no, you're so good. <laughs> okay. Next, we're going to do... You want me to bring my mouthwash? We can <laughs> wash out our <laughs> mouth. <laughs> yeah, that's going to change. <laughs> we'll spit into the water cup. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That's super gross. Okay. So next one is uh, body mass. Bow, uh, bowel movement. <laughs> uh, blueberry <laughs> matcha. Blueberry matcha. Cheers. Cheerios. Let's see how this goes. Cheerios. Mm, this one smells sweet right away. It's very sweet. Very blueberry. So it smells like... Um, did you ever buy those cereals? The, the ones that um, they used to sm sell with a like, Count Chocula and... Oh, those uh, are like my favorite. Yeah, this one smells like the boo berry. Yes, blueberry, Count Chocula, uh, some uh, Frankenberry. Frankenberry, right. there yeah, you go. Yeah. Okay, so let me taste it because I'm talking. Which is good. It's a you get big hints of blueberry, not so much the matcha, but definitely hints of blueberry. Um, it's not as hoppy as I normally like my IPAs. I know I've normally said that I like my my IPAs to be so hoppy 
that it makes me sneeze when I'm drinking it. This definitely will not make me sneeze. I I like the maltier IPAs, which is why I think this is actually tastier than I thought it was going to be. Because I was afraid it was going to be really sweet. Yeah, no, it's it's not sweet. It it smells very sweet. Mm Mm-hmm. Do you taste the blueberry, though? A little bit. Yeah. And I'll confess, I'm not a big blueberry fan. Oh, wow. It's like you don't like anything that's good for you. No, I don't. (laughs) That's why I'm in the shape that I'm in. (laughs) My rotund self. All right. Save the best for last. Down the hatch. Maple cream. (laughs) The MC. The MCs. Holy shit. Yeah, this thing smells like you could pour it right on your pancakes. On your pancakes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that ruin it. Good lord, that's so... (laughs) <laughs> that would ruin it. <laughs> oh, that would ruin it. Okay. Ooh. Mm, that's too sweet for me. And I, I swear I don't like it. Yeah, and I think this one isn't very sweet. What? But maybe because we've been like what are you hard ba- <laughs> hardballing four different uh, flavors in like less than five minutes. So. Yeah, that's true. But these, I didn't feel like those were that sweet. But this one is very sweet. That's why I think if this is finally, it's not sweet to you, then I feel like you're rinsing your mouth with like sugar or something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So order of Operation. your ranking. Oh. Or <laughs> what's the order of your ranking? Pregnancy for the most part in the order that we tasted them. Probably the Dunkin' really? Pumpkin is first. Mm-hmm. Well, I'll be I'll be honest. Mm-hmm. I'm not a big fan of either of these. I don't of what? Of either of these Any of four them. flavors. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Okay. Yeah. I guess I was expecting them to be a lot su- sweeter mm-hmm. and, and uh, a lot richer. See, see. So I kind of feel a little bit let down because they're much milder than what I anticipated. So I would probably say Dunkin' Pumpkin is probably my first favorite. And then um, Dunkin' Midnight. Mm-hmm. And then from there, I'm probably going to do the switcheroo. It's going to be the blueberry matcha. And then the maple cream. Actually, that's the maple, maple cream. Maple, maple cream. No, no, actually, after the midnight, <laughs> yeah, it's going to be the maple cream. Right. And then the blueberry matcha is my least favorite. Yeah. It's the grotiest, as you would say. The <laughs> if we were in seventh grade, I would. So for, for me, I think... Definitely the Midnight was my favorite. And then the Blueberry Matcha IPA. The Pumpkin, believe it or not. And that Maple Cream. You can you can have all my, my Maple Creams. All right. I'll yeah. get, well, actually, the Midnight is not that bad. I'll give you my Blueberry Matchas. The Midnight was my favorite. That, yeah. was, that was my second favorite. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I really did like it. <clears throat> all in all, I think you guys should taste them because they're really not as sweet as you think they'll probably be. If that's what's worrying anybody. Yeah, they're not sweet. Um, they're not particularly rich. So if that's what you were expecting, you will be disappointed. That's what I was expecting. Sweet and rich. That's sweet how we like rich. the. Uh, that's boyfriends. how I like my women. Yeah. So we hope that you enjoyed the video. If you're watching us on the YouTubes, remember to like and subscribe. And if you haven't checked out our podcast already, if you somehow stumbled upon us randomly on the YouTubes, yeah. uh, check out our podcast at technicallyaconversation.com. And Jose and Isela, out. Out.